Two people have been arrested in connection to a shooting of a Miami-Dade police officer. That's right. NBC 6's Lorena Inclan is live from Miami Gardens. And Lorena, the suspects are facing attempted murder charges. They are, Sherna, serious charges for two 19-year-olds. Right now, we're on Northwest 154th Street near 18th Avenue. And according to the police report, uh, while detectives were surveilling this area for an unrelated shooting, they spotted three men with guns in front of this home that you're seeing now. And as officers approached in their vehicle, they began shooting. Nearby home surveillance video captured the barrage of bullets that followed. Take a listen. Now you heard there are several shots being fired and then there's a brief silence and the shooting picks back up again. Another video angle sh shows three people jumping a fence into someone's backyard shortly after that shooting. Miami-Dade police have arrested and charged 19-year-olds Travis Fernandez Jr. and Draquan Humes. Both are facing attempted second-degree murder charges. Now according to the arrest report, the officer who was shot identified Fernandez as the shooter while Humes admitted to firing shots at the officer's vehicle. I want the community to know that I would not be tolerating subjects firing upon the officers. I'm going to provide whatever resources there is to ensure that our officers are protected as well as the citizens of Miami-Dade County. Now, the officer who was injured, grazed by that bullet in his face, has been released from the hospital and is recovering at home now. In the meantime, Miami-Dade police still need the community's help. They say if anyone knows any information about what happened here yesterday in this neighborhood, to please call them. Reporting live from Miami Gardens, Lorena Anclan, NBC6 News.